Locha, 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 locha. My name is Mampu Giwahaj Taudze. My name is Mampu Giwahaj Taudze. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let us introduce ourselves. Uh, simple. We'll try to be brief. Uh, we have an ideology of Mampugism, cultural restorations. Uh, many women and men, they sat down and they saw that there is a need to bring more campaigns about cultural restorations on the public domain. In this case, they chose an ideology which was born among the vendor people, Mampugism. Mampugism is originally from a bird called Mampugi. It's an eagle called Mampugi. Some people can call it a hawk, whatever it is. But what is interested here, the approach is from that eagle. When an animal is dead, it takes only one eye and leaves the rest to vultures, jackals to feed. So the idea is to bring an awareness that all public representatives, be the government, must have an approach of Mampugism. So to live for the rest, they must take a small portion. It can be a traditional leader, the political leader, the president, the cabinet. They must have that mindset of taking only an eye and leaving the rest to vultures and jackals and other animals too to feed on good meat, liver, steak. That's what it should be. And the mind of sharing. Let us share. Don't take the whole animal for yourself. That is all about Mampugism in brief. But it's an ideology that uh, touches a lot of uh, things affecting the African cultures. So we want to leave our culture we don't want to observe our culture as it has been done, whereby we are encouraged to observe our culture, maybe on the month of May, maybe on the month of September only. But we are encouraging a full cultural restoration. That is about our campaign. Uh, we touch whereby some of our traditional leaders were harassed many years during the colonialism, uh, whereby the chieftainship were taken and given to those who were obedient to the colonial rule, and those families the royal families are still waiting for their chieftainship to be restored and uh, it has been not done. The good example that he makes the whole campaign on the traditional uh, restoration, we have taken a, a case of the Chitaudze 
uh, chieftainship in Bedbridge, Zimbabwe, uh, Bedbridge West constituents. That is one of our interested uh, case whereby the Stouze people are still fighting to get uh, back their chieftainship, which was given to another irrelevant and uh, not legitimate leader during the colonial rule, just because those ones, the, the, the relevant and the legitimate, were resisting the occupation and uh, were not uh, cooperative, so they were punished for that. And that punishment is still hanging on that family for more than 100 years. So this is one of our uh, campaign. So we would like us to pay attention on these thousand people. That is why you hear the spokesman of this campaign is called Mampu Giwach Taudze. So we are not about uh, trying to promote a personal ability here. We are promoting a collective ability as Africans. We are going to do intercontinental campaigns to make sure that all the traditional leadership which were disturbed by the colonial rule are restored. So ladies and gentlemen, join us in this interesting campaign and on this well-selling Mampugism, it's a brand of Africa, it's an ideology of Africa, it's an ideology that you cannot stop participating in developing it. As we have given in the, in the, the, the introduction, work with us so that we can work together to develop an ideology of our own, an ideology that is relevant, an ideology, an ideology that is necessary. So when you follow us daily, on daily basis, we'll be packing or we'll be unpacking summary on what we think, what is all about Mampugism. To tell the fact any government that has no interest or that has no Mampugism approach, it is irrelevant itself. We are not talking politics or party politics where we want to change regimes, but we want to influence and educate regimes so that they can adopt 